In today's video, we're going to look at a few barn style venues. It's hot. All right, ladies and gentlemen, it's really hot outside today, so I'm going to kind of take this a little bit easier on myself than I typically do. I typically script out a lot of things and then read the script. But today, I think it's going to just be a little more relaxing. We're just going to look at some barn style venues here in Oklahoma City. And the idea of this is to kind of help take some of the research out of your day that you don't have to, if you're looking for a barn style venue, you don't have to go through as much stress tracking down some really gorgeous ones. I've got a few right here, and one of them that I'm a little bit biased towards because I, I love this place and I love the owners a lot. Um, but we're gonna just kind of explore their websites, explore some photos and explore what they offer to you. And um, let's get to it. Something I also wanna say is that some of these places, I've not even explored them or their websites or what they offer. So we really are doing this together. The first place we're looking at now is gonna be the McGranahan Barn. Now this barn automatically from the webpage is gorgeous. I'm just staring at it and it's, it's already beautiful. I like it already. Um, looks like they have a few people who've said some really nice things about them and their blogs and um, the Brides of Oklahoma have had them featured, which is really cool. Some really nice photos on their websites. Looks like they've, they've done some military weddings, which is really awesome. Off the bat, I can see where they uh, where they have some extra seating upstairs and on this loft. That's always nice. An outdoor ceremony space. It's really cool. I can see this being really pretty for photos uh, at sunset. Okay, I see this is another place they can have ceremonies. There's the barn and they come down this aisle into the ceremony space. Sounds seems like a little bit of a walk for a bride, but I mean, I've I've seen I've, actually I have seen longer. Some beautiful photos. It's a beautiful dress. And then an indoor ceremony, which is a really nice thing to see. Um, you always want to make sure you have a space to do an indoor ceremony just in case it starts raining. This is Oklahoma, and when it rains, it pours here. Of course, you guys know that. My lips are dry today as well. Yeah, some gorgeous photos. Um, and it looks like, hey, we have this, uh, we have this same little badge. We, we were on that same uh, website. We're really happy with that. Okay, um, let's look. Some kind words. Looks like they have some testimonials here. Um, a lot of testimonials. I love it. it means a lot. Pop-up shops. I wonder what that means. Coming soon. Can't wait to see what that turns into. Barn bride and grooms. Looks like some more testimonials, maybe. More beautiful photos. Ooh, I love this one. I love that one a lot. I like the barn. Man, I'd love to go to a styled shoot there. Um, event photos, more photography. Decor rental. What can you rent from these guys? Looks like you they have a lot of decor you can rent. I love the lights. One thing I really like about the barns, you know, they're, they're, they're big and in right now, but I think for a good reason. They're gorgeous. They give really good skin tones. Um, and a lot of them come with these these lights, and it's it just makes for a gorgeous video and photo session. Let's see what more can they preferred vendors. They have preferred vendors on here. We are not one of them, but at least you know if you're looking for uh, your cake or you're looking for your florist, um, then you know you can you can go down here and go on their list and and find some vendors that they really like and that kind of helps eliminate a little bit of the hassle of having to search down quality vendors when people kind of tell you what they have. I'm not seeing anywhere on here for prices. Um, frequently asked questions maybe. Do you allow alcohol? Yes. Is setup allowed the day before or prior to our rental time beginning at noon? All setup is restricted to your rental period. Um, I'm not seeing anything. Do you allow candles? We allow candles that are enclosed in glass or metal containers. That's a good idea, seeing as you're a barn. Um, 
not seeing anything on pricing, so I like to see at least some kind of general pricing on a website, but this is a gorgeous place. That, that doesn't take away from how gorgeous or, or worth visiting this place would be. Um, if you want to watch this video and then go out to these places and see them, that would be a great idea. Next one up, we're actually going to look at one. We have, a, we have two weddings uh, coming up here at the Esperanza Ranch. This is a gorgeous place. If you've never even looked into the Esperanza Ranch, this is a fantastic place. The barn is, is gorgeous. I love this faded wood look they have going on here, and it's probably natural, and, and they just kept it looking gorgeous. But we'll look at the, uh, we'll look at the about real quick. That's a little loading heart thing, too. I like that cutesy stuff. About the ranch. It's a premium, authentic ranch and barn destination for Oklahoma weddings and events. Esperanza Ranch. The word Esperanza means hope or expectation in Spanish. I didn't know that, actually. And that is exactly what our special event venue represents. It is a place where you can come and celebrate life with the full expectation that you'll walk away with great memories of weddings, anniversaries, quinceañeras, business events, and special occasions of every kind. What a gorgeous... What a gorgeous place. This, is this a candle? It looks like it's a candle. It's really pretty. I'd love to have that candle. I uh, have a collection of stuff that we've gotten from weddings. Um, just little little gifts that, you know, your your gifts you give to your guests. And everybody always gives us gifts and it's so sweet and so we save them. Um, weddings. Yeah, this is, this is what I mean. This place is absolutely gorgeous. I'm sure we'll look at some photos. Uh, and there's a video on here, and I'd hate to get... I, don't, I doubt I would get copyright struck, but I'd, I'd hate to have this video get copyright struck. Um, but we'll, we'll look at some photos. Yeah, I mean, there's there's some. Right? I don't, don't want to ruin the photos. I want to get to uh, the gallery real quick. I'm really excited to, uh, to, to shoot this place. Uh, upcoming. I really want to do a, a long exposure shot with this waterfall, just kind of similar to that. Kind of similar to that. Um, photos are lovely, but we invite you to our Ansperanza Ranch in person. Yeah, they're, they're very inviting. They're very inviting. Come out and take a tour. Uh, and this one's a little bit further away from Oklahoma City, but it's it's definitely worth it. Look at this gorgeous, like, this is, this is beautiful. Like, I can't imagine a bride getting ready on her day who would not want a massive light-up mirror like this. Uh, to, to be able to see herself getting ready in. And I'm sure my wife was a hairstylist. Uh, she's not anymore. She's my assistant and she, she shoots weddings with me. But uh, I know as a cosmetologist, she would love a mirror like this to be able to really cut hair and, and style hair in front of. I think it's gorgeous. And yeah, this is this is, this is is inside. And man, look at this concrete. I, I, I love, I love a good concrete. Maybe that's weird. Uh, I don't mean the ice cream. Um... <laughs> All right, and uh, on to the uh, onto the place that we're that we're excited to look at uh, our pricing, pricing and availability. It says book a tour, uh, but down here it has some general pricing, and I'm actually really surprised, guys. the The pricing for Esperanza Ranch is not a not a horrible horrible price at all. Saturday is the most expensive day of the week, and it's sixty five hundred. Now it's only a fifteen hundred dollar non refundable deposit, so that's that's really not bad. And just depend just. I mean, realizing that 6,500 gets you this venue is is a great is a great deal. Um, now, obviously, have corporate stuff and quinceanera um, and celebration pricing. I apologize for my uh, my I apologize for my crappy rolling of the tongue. I, I'm not very good at it. Uh, photo booth pricing 650 a day, which is also a great idea. I'd hate to steer you away from having photographers or even booking us as your photographers, but having a photo booth is a really fun thing that I always encourage people to do. Um, it, it, it's a little bit of money, but it's but it's so worth it. And then this is cool. I actually actually haven't really seen a place offer these marquee uh, lights. I think it's really cool. Three hundred dollars a day. Come on. Party games pricing two hundred dollars a day. You can add that on. And I, it looks. I mean, I keep scrolling past it, but it looks like it says get our thousand dollar all-inclusive bundle save 150 dollars by bundling games marquee lights and a photo booth come on that's just that's just great that's just that's just awesome yeah give give esperanza ranch a check out it's a beautiful place um and I, I it's not one i would i would pass up looking at even though i've i've it's not one i would pass up looking at 
Now, the next one's gonna be The Barn at the Woods. And they have this beautiful video that just plays as soon as you come to their website. It's gorgeous. And I love the LUT is what the, uh, what the little overlay, the coloring is called. Rustic elegance for your best day. I think that is exactly what we're about to see out of this venue. Uh, let's, I think this is probably already home, but let's just make sure, yeah, it is. All right. 40 acre event space designed to take your wedding or special event beyond extraordinary. Nestled along tree-lined Bluff Creek in Edmond, Oklahoma, the barn at the woods is a unique 40-acre property ideal for wedding and special events. The barn and woods, the barn at the woods, features a 115-year-old historic barn, a luxury farmhouse, an idyllic cottage. The acreage also features the wedding tree, formed by two trees that have grown together as one, the ideal backdrop for your ceremony. That is, that's something. That's something. I I, I want to call it the tree itself gorgeous, but more the thing is more gorgeous about it is just what they what they've said about it. The two trees growing together is really cool. Um, obviously a very romantic place. Everything about their website is romantic, and I'm pretty sure that's exactly what you're gonna experience when you go there. Uh, let's go to their services. See what they have. <laughs> I like that. Hold on. Let's see if I can refresh that. I like that first shot. <laughs> I don't know if he's falling over or what's happening. But that's a that's a that's a good shot. I'm glad, glad whoever that was got that shot. Um, magical fairy tale setting. Yeah, I definitely agree with that. I really want to look at this video, but I'll have to do that off camera just in case there's music. Um, yeah. Oh, that's a pretty house too. Look at this. That's really pretty. Just look at some photos here. Beautiful chandelier. I love people with chandeliers and barns. It's just such two opposite worlds coming together. It's a really, really fun thing to see. Ooh, I really like this. That table just goes forever. And that's that's such interesting. This tree is very heavy on the side. I'd love to see if it, if like it all bloomed at the same time. And it was just a full tree. It'd probably be gorgeous. Couples table. I like the uh, falling apart wood back here because a little bit of a I just the, the reason barns work so well in my opinion is just because you have this old rustic worn down thing that a celebration is going on a, a beautiful put together expensive celebration is going on inside I think that's what the the, the draw is towards barn weddings uh, and and I think it's great really cool dress shot there we go. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah, there we go. I'm a, uh, I'm a photo person. I love, love looking at wedding photos. That's why we started uh, doing weddings ourselves. We'll get more into that in a video at a later time. But I love looking at photos. So yeah, we'll, we'll move on past that. Um, they have a blog here, and obviously, and I'm sure it's going to be, yeah, it's going to be a lot of um, people's Weddings that, they, that have been held out there. Peace out 2020 brunch giveaway, which is pretty cool. I like this. A lot of uh, a lot of venue blogs have nothing to do other than with just the couples ceremonies. I think it's really great that they do that. I just like to see. I like to see a blog like this that has extra stuff in there. Uh, the intentional ceremony. That's great. I'll, I actually, I'm actually probably gonna love that. Wild love styled shoot. I, ooh, so pretty, so pretty. All right, I'm gonna back off. Um, let's go over to. Um, well, I'd love to see some pricing on here. I don't think we're going to get it. They want you to schedule a tour and sh so you can fall in love with the place, which makes absolute sense. I like. Okay, here's something I really like. This here is called a 360 video. Uh, and surely this was done with a 360 camera, probably the Insta 360 1R. And yeah, um, this this plays really well on your phone. You can view it in virtual reality, which is a really cool thing. Um, we actually do these for weddings, uh, for video. Um, so if you guys are interested in that, it's something we don't advertise a whole lot, but. Uh, because it doesn't make a lot of money, but it's it's definitely worth doing. It makes a beautiful, beautiful, uh, relivable experience out of your ceremony. Uh, yeah, so I don't see anything. 
book our venue within four months of your wedding date and receive 25% discount. That's not a bad deal. Uh, you just gotta, you just gotta hope that your wedding's open, your wedding date is open. Uh, I'm not seeing anything about pricing. Maybe I've missed it, and if I've missed it, I really sincerely do apologize, but not seeing anything on pricing. Yeah, um, definitely a place to look at and, and call them and, and let them know what how many people you're going to have at your wedding, how long you want it to be, what day you want it to be on, and I'm sure they'll be able to give you a pricing, um, general pricing at least. And then the last one we're going to look at is going to be uh, Rustic Rose Barn. Now, Rustic Rose Barn is a place that holds a it, it holds a very special place in mine and Sierra's hearts. Our very first wedding that we ever photographed was here. Uh, we recently shot a video, uh, and that'll go up on YouTube here soon, um, and it'll be on our website. But Rustic Rose Barn is a gorgeous place, and we Sierra and I really love the the venue owners. They're very sweet people. They make sure to stay on site the entire time that you're having your wedding to make sure if you need anything at all that you can you can get a hold of them. They're there with you the entire time. They actually, <laughs> uh, the first wedding we shot there, it was super cute. They have they have donkeys and they have some animals that they can actually bring over. Um, and I'm not sure if they charge for that or not, but I would talk to them. It, it's kind of a little petting zoo type thing that they bring their donkeys over on a lead and the little kids can pet it. And that makes for some really great photo and video, I'll tell you that much. Um, um, so yeah, about. So let's go to the about real quick. All right, here at the about page, uh, Rustic Rose Barn is here to help your special day be both amazing and memorable. Features include barn venue built entirely with yellow Georgian pine, temperature controlled, seats 200 plus guests. And let me tell you, it definitely seats 200 plus guests. Bridal suite with bathroom, shower, snack area, and lounge area. Groom's quarters prep kitchen, bar, open to ceremony and reception area. Indoor restrooms includes family restroom with handicap accessible baby changing area. Other features. And this is this is a really gorgeous shot. I love this. 20 acres. Uh, it's on 20 acres. It has a pavilion overlooking a three acre pond, which is a gorgeous view. Uh, tree lined. It, it's lined with trees. Uh, it has a windmill on on there. It has a long it has longhorn cattle off to the left as you're looking at the barn at front. Um, it has mini donkeys. Okay, they do include that on here. And an antique truck, which is a gorgeous place to take photos. We have those photos on our website. Uh, plenty of free parking. <laughs> they don't charge for parking. Thank God. Um, some downtown venues that you'll find here in Oklahoma City. Uh, they don't have a choice but to charge for parking. And they're just minutes away from Northwest Oklahoma City in Edmond. Yeah, they're they're out in Guthrie. Um, but they're they're not a very far drive away if you just hit 74 and, or Portland and just go straight north. Um, it's pretty easy to get there. And man, this place is gorgeous. Uh, contact. I, Gallery, I don't think any of our photos are up on the website. Yeah, they, they have some of our photos on their Instagram. Um, and they have a blog, which is really nice. They can kind of... There we go. We love our country, we love our vendors. Let's freaking go. This place is amazing, guys. I'm telling you, this is one of our favorites. And I'm not gonna say our favorite, because I'd hate to I'd hate to alienate anybody, but this is one of our favorite for sure places um, to, to tell people to go if they're looking for a barn venue. Um, wedding planning tips. There we go. Let's go, come on. This is what I like to see. This this is a this is a venue that likes to help out couples and help them, you know plan their wedding and they once again they have a lot of decorations they have the tables the chairs uh, they have a lot they have an on-site kitchen so a lot of the stuff that you're already going to want is going to be there they have decorations that they that that are pretty much universal for almost every wedding and makes it gorgeous and they have those string lights that i was telling you about that i love a beautiful chandelier beautiful barn doors that open straight up sideways that gives a, a really great view and good for photos too they have a uh uh, they have space to do an indoor ceremony if it were if something were to happen. Um, but there, there's a gorgeous spot underneath um, this pavilion uh, to have your ceremony if you if you don't have a massive crowd. If you have a larger crowd, you can actually do your ceremony in front of this kind of arch, this wooden arch thing uh, they have out there, uh, and and it's just absolutely beautiful. So 
All right, guys, uh, I just wanted to show you guys four beautiful barn venues we have here in Oklahoma City. Hopefully, this helps you pick a barn style venue. If you guys have any other venues here in Oklahoma City that are barn style that you want to talk about and you want to share, put them down in the comments below. I'm sure people would love to hear about all their other choices. But if I have to choose one, they'd be the Rustic Rose Barn. I just love the place and I love the people. So, thank you guys very much. Hit like, hit subscribe, and we'll see you next time.